Hello viewers, good morning, good afternoon, good evening to you all, depending on where you are watching us from. Ejimofo is my humble name. Two of our students came up uh, arguing about a particular assertion. Their teacher told them when they were in primary school. They brought it to us and uh, we told them that uh, what their teacher said back then was very, very true. And I want to prove it to you also mathematically. The assertion is that the higher you go above the sea level, the cooler or rather colder it becomes. That is the assertion. I told them that the teacher was was correct then. So I want to prove it to you mathematically. This is a particular, assuming this is a house, one uh, ten story building, four story building or whatever, or a mountain or, or whatever. And the height of this uh, base is uh, 3,500 for instance. And uh, there are people here, there are people on the floor. Look at them. Look at this one. There are people this side. There are people here. And there are people here also. There are people here also. There are people who live here. These are people on top. These are people on top. Are you getting the point now? These are people, are, these are people on top. Now we want to know if actually this could be a person cooler weather or not. If the weather here is cold, cooler than what is the what is could here I experience it. Alright, let us look at it now. Let us give the temperature here that one degree Celsius, for instance. Before we go, know that there is something called lapse rates. Lapse rates. Last week is the tendency at which temperature drops at a certain altitude or at a certain height. I get to the point now. Now, it has a particular standard for normal atmospheric temperature. At every 1000 meters, temperature drops by 6.5 degrees Celsius. If temperature drops by 6.5 degrees Celsius at 1000 meters, now let us now ask ourselves. What will be the temperature drop at 3,500? Now, at 3,500 meters now, what will the temperature drop will be? We don't know. Let us assume that this x, right, this point, this place now is a point x, for instance. Now, cross multiply. When you cross multiply now, you are going to have a 1,000 x equal to this, and this will give us um, 22,750. Correct. This is what it will give us. Now, how do we get x and the sign of the How do we get x? The Bible sign by the coefficient of x to get x. So we're going to have 1000 x over, over 1000 equals 22,750 over 1000. 1000 will go, x will remain. We have this and this. 2750. 22.75 degrees Celsius. So let us now look at it. This is the temperature, base temperature. Base temperature at 1 degree Celsius. Temperature at the top, which is X, this place now. Top temperature is 22.75 degrees Celsius. So compare the two. When you compare the two, you find out that it is hotter here than here. And it has automatically been proved that uh, the higher you go, that means if you put like a, um, something like 4,000, the, the distance increases now, the temperature will also drop. If you doubt it, maybe this height now, like uh, 4,000, 
use the same temperature as my clock is now. This one now may go down to now carry either 21, 22. I get any point now. That means the higher the altitude now, the cooler the temperature becomes. That is the Thank you so much. If this is the first time of encountering this lesson on this channel, can you subscribe to our YouTube channel? Share and make sure you follow all our social media platforms, TikTok, Instagram and Facebook. Thank you so much and see you in our next video.